Good day, everyone. How are you doing today? This is Crypto Foxy. Thanks so much for stopping back by the channel. Um, in this video, I want to talk to you about Solana and uh, what we're seeing on the chart for Solana, uh, what's been happening since the uh, the Binance issue yesterday with CZ um, being charged and uh, pleading guilty, basically, and uh, resigning from Binance. Uh, the market is digesting it rather well, in my opinion, um, so far, right? Um, so we're going to have a look and see what the market is doing today and what could be in store for Solana. We're going to also look at some technical analysis. Before we get into it, though, please make sure you hit the like button. You're subscribed to my channel. And let's get into our video here. Um, so we can see here that let's just refresh this, make sure we get the latest info. Um, we're just sitting under 1.4 trillion on the cryptocurrency, overall cryptocurrency market. So Solana is sitting at number seven, um, slightly up on the uh, the hour and uh, up 2% on the 24 hour, sitting at $55. Um, so let's have a look and see what's going on here because there has uh, been rumors of a sell-off brewing. Um, so we can see Whale Alert has shared in an X post earlier today that a whale has transferred a huge amount of Solana tokens to an exchange. The transferred Solana was worth approximately $10.4 million. Um, so rumors of a possible sell-off circulated with the cryptocurrency community and among traders. Talks of a sell-off might not be far-fetched as Sol price has decreased by 1.89% over the past 24 hours of trading. That has uh, since recovered slightly as we, as we just saw. Uh, more than 28% increase in its 24-hour volume, which ended up taking the total volume to $2.5 billion. Any blows dealt to the Sol price could be softened by the recent announcement made by the Bit uh, Exchange. According to the exchange founder, Jihan Wu, the firm is all set to launch Solana options trading following the colossal surge in institutional demand. So institutional demand. So we are considered retail investors. Obviously, institutional would be, you know, big, big players with uh, lots of money. Uh, Solana did drop below the key 5695 support level over the past 48 hours and continue to trade below this level at press time. So what could we expect to see for the price? Well, if Solana closes today's daily candle under 56.95, then it could be at risk of dropping um, down to the 47.60 at the support level there uh, through the course of the next few days. This bearish thesis may be invalidated if it closes a trading session above 56.95 within the next 48 hours. So we will be watching this closely to see where it goes. If Solana does get down into the um, the high 40s, like I'm thinking around you know, $48 range, I am looking at opening a position. Uh, I'm currently not in Solana right now, but uh, I am looking for an entry point uh, for the next run up. Um, so that is uh, obviously not financial advice. This is my uh, my own opinion. I've been watching the, uh, the chart closely and that is uh, where I'm going to get in at. So this could give the altcoin the foundation needed to rise to the subsequent resistance level at 68 if it does um, invalidate the, uh, the bearish thesis if we actually close um, above the 56.95 in the next 48 hours. So that would be um, uh, bullish as well for a shoot up. Um, but I'm looking to get in, you know, just above this level here. I'm not going to wait for it to hit. Uh, I might wait for it to hit support, but I'm not 100% sure. I am going to keep an eye on it, though. Um, we can see, um, you know, the market has not been... Uh, has been digesting this uh, Binance news relatively well. I honestly uh, expected a bit more of a dip here, but um, we're going to see what happens and I'll keep tabs on that for you guys. Uh, thanks so much for tuning in to this video. That's what I have for you on the, uh, the price action with Solana for today. And uh, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thanks for tuning in.